The DPP decided Wednesday to set up a China Affairs Committee. The former Premier Frank Xie, who recently visited China, will not head the committee. While DPP Chairman Su Zhenchang will instead lead the body, which will be set up to act as a forum for the party to thrash out its China policy. The party's new China Affairs Committee is being seen as a platform for internal discussion on China policy, in contrast to its China Affairs Department which will be used to engage with China. One is to research policy, while the other can take the lead in exchanges. SOPs for visiting China will also be set through this type of mechanism. Former Premier Frank Xie, who is seen as favorable to China, was not chosen to head the committee. Some think it was because of pressure from the party's pro-independence faction. But one Xie backer says that wasn't the case. To make the independence faction and exchanges with China mutually exclusive, that's really unfair to Premier Xie. I heard Premier Xie say early on that if it involved engaging with China, he was willing to take on the responsibility. But if it was a platform for building a consensus, he felt he did not have to be the one to do the job. After the China Affairs Committee finishes its discussions, its conclusions will be passed to the Central Standing Committee. So I think that based on that framework, who heads the committee is not a big deal. The committee has yet to begin operations, but it's already sparked debate in a party where China policy has always been a sensitive issue.